Kenny for 70 minutes, you were still in it, and then it all went away from you. Yeah, it's a competitive performance, very competitive ultimately. You know, we've we've conceded two from set pieces. You know, the three goals they've scored in um, in you know in the whole of the tie, two from corners and one from a wide free kick to, today, and um, you know Matt, Matt Smith's sort of headed one down after that. I can't quite see how it sort of squirmed its way in. Really, to be honest, with you. it looked like we you know we had enough and defended it, but it headed down by Smith uh, in the box for the first one, and then you know a bullet header from a wide free kick. Uh, straight in and, and you know it's coming over the, the likes of Ollie Hawkins Matt Clark Christian Burgess people like that in those situations so he's a big player for them and he was tonight in terms of being a focal point uh, they, they could play off him and ultimately you know he's made the difference I thought from our side it was a competitive performance I thought at times we, we passed the ball well and played but, but, but generally for the majority of the game we couldn't get you know a cutting edge we couldn't get the shots in you know we couldn't get the shots in that troubled them and, and you know that's something that in terms of team selection and, 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 and options now going forward, we, we have more options. A um, little bit of a flurry at the end when we're two 0 down, and you know both fullbacks got into crossing positions. Hawkins had a header down. Uh, um, you know Gareth Evans got into position. Uh, 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 Brett, but uh, Matt Clark had probably one good chance. You know that was in injury time, but um, uh, just generally a very competitive performance. Uh, ultimately, you know undone by two set pieces, three in the two. In the in the two games we've had, but but tonight, you know, we, we uh, um, uh, uh, as well as we competed, we do need to be able to find you know shots on top of that. Yeah, were you disappointed with the chances you created? Yeah, we, we couldn't. You know, we we were flat out. To be fair, I did think quite a lot, quite a number of the players were really flat out tonight and gave everything. But as I said, you know, ultimately, uh, we want to be able to. Uh, be effective going forward as well, and, and you know, particularly our, our counter attacking this season has been a you know a feature, and and it's you know got us uh, 50 goals pretty quick, and and you know we need to be able to get that back. It's up to now five games without a win. How do you turn that around? Because that becomes as in, uh, contagious as winning becomes infectious. Yeah, it's not it's not a nice feeling definitely, and to go out of the competition, but you know in this particular competition we've. We've had a good run. Um, we've given some some good sides, um, you know, a, a run for their money, and got through several rounds. So the, the, you know, there's no uh, shame in that. As you said, you know, it's a situation where we'll be looking to kick back as quickly as we possibly can, get as strong as you know, as as as, as um, you know, as as the club will allow, if you like, in terms of players, players available, players ready to go again, and uh, you know, we, we will be able to then turn it and turn these into wins. Any news on Jack Watmore today? Yeah, the news isn't good for Jack. Uh, he will need an operation, and um, you know we'll assess it probably, maybe maybe again in a, in a in a you know in another week. But um, you know there is a tear there, and uh, you know it's something that, that that won't heal itself. So you know it will be operated on. I would think in the next seven days.